In this video, we're going to see just how loud the Sapphire Radeon Pulse RX 5500 XT 8GB OC card gets. And then how loud it is right when you boot up your system, when it's just sitting there idle, and then how loud it can get if you push it. Check it out. Hold on, don't forget to click like, subscribe, and the little bell notification. That way you know when I come out videos just like this. So again, I'm going to show you guys just how loud the Sapphire Pulse Radeon RX 5500 XT 8GB card gets. So the system's on right now, and this has gotten up to 60 because I'm talking. About 22 dB. I've seen it get as low as 19 dB. I don't have my microphone on, so there is echo, but I want you to hear everything I hear. Right now, the side panel is on, so I'm going to bring you closer with the side panel off so that you can see the bottom of the card and you can see what I see. So, one sec. All right, so as we can see with the system idle, the fans are not spinning and we're hitting 30 dB. This is with the phone inside of the case. That way it can get the most sound it's gonna get. Okay, the camera itself is about a foot and a half away from the PC itself. PC does not have a side panel on. Okay, so again, we're at 30 dB, the fans are not spinning. All right, so let's go over to, since Unfortunately, Trix at the moment does not have any way of changing the fans, tells you the dashboard, information about the card, harbor monitor, and Trix boost. Unfortunately, none of this allows us to change the fan speeds. So if I right click on the desktop and go to the AMD Radeon software, they have this great new utility now it's not totally new, but this, this part is very new. So I'm going to switch this to automatic for now, or should I say, go back to manual and fan tuning is disabled. I'm going to go ahead and turn that on. You can see we're at 35 and I'm going to go ahead, apply those changes. Okay, we're at about, let's say 36 dB. And if we come over here to metrics, you can see the fans are spinning at about 1600 RPM. Okay, coming back over here to tuning, I'm gonna go ahead, open up the advanced control and I'm going to raise this to 50%. Sorry, battery's almost dying. Okay, let's say we're at 44 dB. And let's see what we are under metrics. We're at 2200 RPM. So now going back to tuning, let's go ahead and bump this up to, that's 75, I guess, yeah, 75. That brings us to 48 dB and fan speed of 2,883 RPM. We can see right over here that we're almost at the very end. So if we bump it up to 100,
we're at about 2908 around there and then we're at Forty nine DB. That's with the fans at a hundred percent. So that's pretty awesome. The fans are incredibly quiet for having two fans, and I'm not gonna put my fingers there because they are spinning, it'll hurt. It's incredibly quiet with the side panels on. Actually, we can see in there, or I, yeah, you could see it went up to 52 dB. That must be echoing, so let's go ahead and take this off again. Yeah, so that's echoing audio. Without it, we're at about 48, 49 dB. So that's incredibly quiet. And again, we're at 100% of that CPU fan, which was 2908, but it's kind of going down here. So I'm gonna go ahead and just disable that here. And it's not gonna be a quick drop in temperatures or anything, or should I say in dB. This is gonna take its time and go down slowly, but this is a little bit of what you have to expect with AMD's latest driver. The 19.12.3. I really like the changes AMD has made to their software and the fact that it lets you control everything from in here it's beautiful but anyway again this is Iggy just showing you the how loud the Sapphire Radeon Pulse RX 5500 XT 8 gigabyte card is out of the box inside of your system right when you turn it on and then how loud it can get but again I had to push it to a hundred but anyway you're gonna see a lot more from me coming soon on this Iggy up. See you guys.